Welcome. Today we are going to learn Maths Lesson 1 Large Numbers. In class 3, we all studied up to 1000. Now we are going to study 10,000 and 1 lakh. So there are many parts in our chapter. First place value, second place value, third expanded form, fourth rounding numbers, fifth comparing numbers, sixth ascending and descending order. There are many topics that we can take in this lesson. So first we can study face value. I think you already study face value in class 3. So we can revise it. Okay. So for example, if the question is given like this 32,100 What is the face value of 2 in 32,100? Uh, what is it? Yeah, see in itself. In class 3, we all study that the digit itself. So, remind it and write the answer. So, now what we can take the next part. Place value. What is mean by place value? Place value means the value of the digit. Value of the given digit. For example, 123. What is the place value of 1 in 123? It's 100. I think you know it. But if I ask you a question, what is the place value of 2 in 12,342? What is the answer of it? There are two, two in this. So, if only underlined digit will come in exam in this like questions. So, leave it. Next, we can study expanded form. Expanded form means we expand a digit. For example, one, seven, uh, six, five. One, seven, six, five. When we expand, it comes as thousand plus seven hundred plus sixty plus five. So I think you all know expanded form. We add the old value of the digits. So if you study this very fast and very or daily, you can do this very fast, rapidly. Next, we are going to study comparing numbers. So, listen. Comparing numbers is easy one. So, compare the number 1, 2 and 2, 1. Which is the smallest number, which is the greatest number. In class 3, we all study, we can put crocodile mouth to represent it. Crocodile mouth or equal to. So, if 12, compare 12 and 21. If you study, I think you all studied this in third standard. But I will say this some more clearly. To compare numbers, we must first find the biggest number. Which is the biggest number in 12 and 21? It's 21. So, open the crocodile mouth to 21. So, it is very easy. If the question is same, means uh, 12, compare 12 by 12. What can we do? We must put an equal to, equal to mark. It's the middle of the 
and so on. Get the point? Next, ascending and descending order. Ascending and descending order, I think you don't know why, what I said now. Because you only studied increasing order and decreasing order. The same meaning is ascending and descending order also is the same meaning. Ascending order means also increasing order. Descending order means decreasing order. In ascending order, if the question is like this, write 21, 32, 43 and other question, other numbers in increasing or ascending order. If so, increasing order means small to big. Decreasing order or descending order means up to small. In the next class, I will explain about rounding numbers. So, study all the topics more. Next day, I will conduct test paper. Put your marks in the comment box.